This is number five in a series of 50 green things you can do to your home now. Okay, solar tubes. Today we're talking about solar tubes, a really neat little product which actually helps us in passive design. I'm always being asked, you know, how much more does green building cost? How much more does it cost to be green? Well, passive design, particularly if it's done up front, really doesn't have to cost anything more. So, and this particular kind of passive design is for lighting design. We call it daylighting. It's simply using the sun to bring in daylight rather than turning on a electrical light which of course saves you electricity which of course saves you money and brightens up dark areas of the home okay so we know if we look at our average home that besides heating and cooling lighting is the biggest chunk that we spend money on that we use energy for in our homes about eleven percent now this is what a solar tube looks like solar tube s-o-l-a-t-u-b-e is the manufacturer of the most common unit that I've seen but basically what it is is it's a little dome that sits on your roof this is a cut section we're looking at here and here's the dome so the sunlight you can turn this dome doesn't have to face south there's a reflector in this dome so if the sunlight's coming in this direction you face the you turn the dome so it accepts the sunlight and then the light comes in here and bounces off this highly polished mirror-like tube which brings the light right down inside your house. Now this would be the ceiling of your house and this would be the attic space. So I know not all houses are constructed this way but this is a average type home. So we're, we're taking the sunlight in. Okay so we're bringing sunlight in through this tube and into the house down below. Now here's a builder's show display of a solar tube as well. You can see there's the the dome on the top. Here's the roof deck mount and you flash this carefully so you don't get water penetrating in here but it's easy to do. These are quite simple to install. You simply need to cut, particularly if you have a composition or a asphalt style shingle roof. Now if you have something like a, a clay tile or a metal roof it's a little bit more challenging but still can be done. So again, here's your roof. Um, then you have the metal pipe that comes down below to your ceiling. And this product has been developed over the years to have a lot of new options that are kind of cool. These are the different lenses. They used to just have one. Now they've got a whole variety of lenses which give you soft light, reflect light. This one here even has a fan, so this would be great in a bathroom where you want to ventilate as well as bring light. Oftentimes bathrooms are located well inside a building and can be quite dark so it's an excellent place to use them. So if we are looking at a basic home, let's say we have a couple bedrooms in the back, maybe there's a bathroom here, living room is up here, kitchen is up here, and you've got this long hallway which goes to the rooms. Solar tubes are excellent on the interior of the building. So these dark areas which don't get daylight can now have daylight. 